Hey everyone, so today what I'm going to try to do, I'm going to be fishing for some crappie hopefully. And while I'm fishing, here I'm going to show you all real quick. So the drop off right here, there's some cover, so that's why I'm going to be fishing. And I hope I can catch some fish off of it. If not, I've got some other place I'm going to try. But what I'm fishing with is my, uh, here we go, is a good old Fluger rod, light, ultra light action with two pound test P line. And I got a simple a bobber. And a little hook. And we're going to be using minnows for bait. So that's what we're going to try. Um, we're going to try a couple different spots. But I'm going to try here first. And I'll let you all know where I find them at. <laughs> Stay tuned. Hopefully we'll catch a whole bunch. Got him. There we go. What we got? A crappie. There we go. That's what we're after. All right. He might make the cut too. There we go. All right, where my crappie checker at? He might. He may, he's right around it. Could be a first keeper, y'all. Yep. He gets in there. Oh yeah, he definitely. Ten half, eleven incher. All right. Let's hope there's more down there. I guess I didn't show them to y'all very good, did I? Here. There he is, first crappie of the day, right there. Nope. Oh. Got him. I don't know if y'all could see that or not. My float went flat on top of the water. That's how I knew I had a fish. He came up from the bottom and hit it. And went up. Probably another crappie. Wait, it's fighting. Yep. Oh, there we go. Alright. This should be another keeper too. Yeah, I hope y'all saw how that float acted. Because it was... It went straight up. Like he hit it from the bottom and kept, uh, and kept going upwards with it. So... I know he's definitely got to be 10 inches. He's probably not going to not run another 11 or 11 or so. Oh, yeah. Easily makes the cut. Yep. One more good look for y'all. Good crappie right there. Good eater. Get him in here. That's two. Maybe we found a spot finally. There we go, there we go. Got him. All right, got me another crappie, yep. He ain't big enough though. He ain't big enough. But important thing is we found a spot with some crappie in it though. There we go. Little guy. No, oh, got a little deformity down there. Thanks for the fight, bud. There he goes. All right. So at this spot here I'm at, it's another big like weed patch here in about 10, 11 foot of water. And I'm fishing right on top of that weed patch. I'm probably fishing actually a little on the side of it, to be honest. I'm probably about, oh, what am I? Where's my thing? Oh, that's not right. That got stuck. But I'm probably right around 10 foot. I'm probably hanging right about in the weeds or right on top of the weeds. Like, I'm really close to it. There's a really this big isolated patch of weeds out here. About 10 foot. And this is where I'm, I found them at so far. But the key to get these guys to bite today seems like it's to be right either in the weed or right above the weeds. There we go. Got him. Yep, that's what I was looking for. Whoa, 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 whoa bud. <laughs> I almost left this spot too. Oh, he just broke my, yep, he broke my hook. 
I don't know if he's big enough or not. I don't think he is. Gotta be 10 inches. I don't think he's 10 inches though. Nah, there's no, no, nah, there's no way this little guy's 10 inches. But I do want back, back my hook though, bud. Can I have my hook back? I'll check you, but you probably would've. What do you think y'all, let me know what y'all think he is. I think he's about, about eight inches. I don't believe he's any bigger than that. All right, let's, let's see how big you are, but just out of curiosity. Oh, that was nine. Oh, yeah, he's, he's definitely a nine incher. Well, looky there, prove me wrong there, buddy. Hey, 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 hey. But, glad I caught him. <laughs> let's let him go. Go on, bud. There he goes. There we go. It's a good crappie right there. There we go. That's definitely a keeper. I think. I don't know. He's he's right around the 10 inch mark. Let's see. Oh yeah. Yep, yep. Definitely a keeper. Alrighty. Calm down there. Alright. Another good little keeper. Let's put him with the, let's put him with the buddies. Right. See if we can get another one. Went a little deeper and bam, got a got a crappie. <laughs> you gotta remember to always uh adjust your depth when you're crappie fishing to find out where they're feeding at. Cause you could be in the perfect spot, but if you don't have it at the right depth. You probably ain't gonna get nothing. Oh, there we go. You guys stuck him, got him. <laughs> I think it's another crappie. Oh yeah, it is. All right, another good crappie right there. Oh goodness. <laughs> Who's doing the net job? My gosh. go I don't know y'all these guys are right all around the same same length which I ain't bad as long as they're all keepers oh oh bent the no I bent my hook real bad <laughs> all right here he is let's see if he's uh if he makes the cut or not another one hey he made it He's right over the 10 inch line. All right. And he goes. That's probably more than enough for me today. All right. I'm gonna go see if I can catch him one more. Oh. Oh. Got him. <laughs> Ooh, he feels decent. Whatever he is. No, no, he's not decent. He's a little crappie. Oh, he's a fighter. He's feisty. <laughs> he's trying to act a little spot of crappie, though. Ow, fin me. I don't know if he'll make the cut or not again. Real close. Nope. Barely over nine. All right, you can go. Whoop. <laughs> hey everyone, so, had a pretty good day. I, I thought for sure in the beginning there was gonna, be, was gonna be terrible, but it turned out to be really, really good day. Um, we caught several crappie. Um, I kept six keepers. So, I mean, that's awesome. 
So what I was doing to catch the fish today, I was using live minnows, two pound test, ultra light rod, and uh, what I was doing, what I was looking for was, I found I found today that the crappie are sitting about 10 foot of water, and they're sitting on uh, weeds. Like this, this, this lake here has, is really weedy. So what I would do, I'd find 10 foot of water, because there wasn't very many weeds in 10 foot of water. But if you find like the patches of weeds that are out there in 10 foot, they seem to be uh, hanging around that pretty well. That's the day. I was fishing 10 foot of water. I was probably I was probably fishing about a foot off the bottom or a foot off, a foot off, or even inside, either a foot above or inside the weeds themselves. So that's what worked for me today. I didn't. I thought, heck, that was great. <laughs> like I said, I really thought I was gonna have a bad day because I wasn't catching nothing. I was out there. I tried like four different spots before I. Um, I, those last last three spots I went to, they did great for me. So I'm really glad it worked out. Um, thank you all so much for watching. Um, please do remember to like, subscribe, hit the bell button, leave a comment down below on any kind of questions you might have for me. I uh, I would be happy to answer any of them. And that y'all, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.